That nine-year-old rescue dog was with a dog walker at the time of the attack. We're now hearing from that dog walker who says another man lost control of his pit bull who then grabbed Frankie by the neck. Local 10's Rush Lowe joins us live with all the new details. Rush. And wait until you hear the dog walker because she is absolutely traumatized. And you can understand it. Here she is walking along on beautiful North Bay Road when all of a sudden this dog races across the street, gets her little Frankie in its jaws, and she thought this dog was going to die. There's no way. I, I was shocked the blood wasn't splurting all over the place. This dog walker still in shock over what happened on North Bay Road to this dog Frankie. Mommy misses you. I'm screaming as the dog comes across. He goes straight to Frankie, right to the jugular. And it's the way, like what you see in nightmares, like 500, well, probably it's exaggerated, uh, 100 shakes, like a lifeless doll. I'm screaming the whole time. Witnesses say a man riding his bike with his dog when the aggressive dog gets loose and goes on the attack. The case was reported to Miami Beach Police. It just didn't seem like a priority. And if people, if this has happened to other people before, it shouldn't happen again. And now let me show you little Frankie. Here's Frankie, the dog's owner, so grateful that Frankie was able to make it on IV fluids. And the woman who was walking Frankie, who witnessed this vicious attack, still obviously very much traumatized. I was in shock, I couldn't cry. Now today I just came from Pilates and tears are rolling down my face. Last night with him under the bed, hes I couldn't tell if he was whimpering or if his lung was gonna collapse. I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna be able to get this vision out of my head. It's like from your worst nightmare. Yeah, it was a pretty horrible scene, but at the end of the day, the dog owner who's out of town says that Miami Beach police told her, look, there's not a lot we can do. This is a civil case. She's obviously very upset, but grateful that Frankie will survive. We're live on Miami Beach tonight. I'm Rosh Lowe, Local 10 News. Certainly a traumatizing situation indeed. All right, Rosh.